strong enough a lot. I mean, you could do it, but not really. I mean, you're going through the motions, but it's it's difficult. I'm going to call it for now. So just a quick summary. Social, practical, spiritual. One leads to the next in terms of preparation as well. Social, somebody listen to you. Yeah, practical. Okay, now I'm going to... You know, it's one, it empties one thing and fills up another. It's almost like uh, <laughs> it's almost like you have two blocks of wood and you're trying to get across the swamp. So you put it, put one down so you can step on it. And once you step on it, you get the other one and put it next. And then you take a little step onto the ones that one in front, get the one in back, put it, and then just sort of almost like leapfrogging your way across uh, uh, through life. And that you can think of it that way. And that there is progress. There are layers as, as consistency creates consistency reveals layers and accommodates growth um, in our family we have we have a, a a saying that everyone is aware of a layer if they it's like a, a series of rugs overlapped from you know uh, let's say uh, how would I how do we do this say one one rug is right here and the other rug is right here over it and the other rug is right there over it. And so it's almost like that hand game where you slap each other's hands down. Um, and everyone can peel off a layer and they find dirt and dust and they clean it. And then they set it back down. Right? Now, that doesn't impede somebody else's removal. It doesn't block them. It just gives them knowledge that what they have to face is not dirty anymore. And then they remove theirs. Oh, wow, that encourages me. Look what you did. And then they clean theirs. And then that really is something. And it's like pinball. It's like atmosphere pinball. <laughs> well, maybe pinball isn't the right word to use. Well, yeah, that could that could work. We all have flippers. We all have bumpers. Bumpers saying no. Flippers saying yeah, this way. And we learn timing, etc. So it's atmospheric pinball. By atmosphere, I mean energy. The energy floating around in the place. Become aware of something, right? That's in terms of function, right? Okay, so as you do that, You become aware. You become aware of more things and you can take care of more things. And this is a practical application. So, uh, you know, we do have a somewhat of a chore schedule. Um, but the needs are needs are the, the focus here. Anytime you do something, you go to do something, you're going to find a need. That need always requires patience in order to fill. And you can't be patient with others until you're patient, unless you're patient with yourself. So social, practical, and spiritual are always dealing with people. You could be dealing with a little bit of yourself and a lot of others or a little bit of others and a lot with yourself. Did I just repeat that? <laughs> you know what I mean? A little with yourself, a lot with others. A lot with yourself, a little bit with others. But you, you're not alone. You're not supposed to be alone. You're not meant to be alone. Uh, you're meant to be mature, You can't, you know, apple trees, in order for them, to, is it apple or is it pear? In order for them to germinate, they have, there needs to be more than one uh, planting. They need to be close. They're supposed to, they cross germinate, or is that cross germinate? They're supposed to, germ that, that's how they germinate. That's how they grow. So, um, you know, I, I face the whole, I have to do it alone. There are things that you have to do alone. Now, that's called a decision. Um, if you feel like you have to do things alone, Two things are happening. One is God's moving you into leadership. And two, you're learning how to see yourself as an owner. If you see yourself as an owner, you're going to do the greatest priority in the order in which you're aware of. Leader knows how to say, uh, leader is the target of every possibility. Oh, you need to do this. You need to do this. Oh, I need this. I need this. It's like you're you're targeted with need. Oh, this person's active. They're moving they're, or, or they're not doing anything. Or, or, or they don't say no, or whatever. And so leadership <coughs> is the second ladder down on a ladder rung where you should be at the top. Ownership is at the top. Once you're at the top, you think, oh, now I see the needs, and I can control what I do. I'm going to choose to do whatever, right? You, freedom comes first. You have to be able to say no. 
you have to be able to recognize your own need and you have to be happy just like a business deal you have to learn to look i don't make business deals and business deals isn't necessarily business deals but the mindset is that i will do whatever you want here but you need to change my life you need to change my circumstances which one of these is the camera and which is the flash? Okay, that's the camera. Keep forgetting. Change my life. Make me happy. Lift me up. Cause me to overflow. And my overflow will be all the sweeter. I want to keep going here. If you don't control yourself, other people will. The only type of control is self-control. <coughs> you might think, oh, I use a steering wheel. A, th a steering wheel is a thing. Things naturally have to bow to people. That's enough for now.